Hi, this is Matthew May with QuickRegisterSEO.com and CoolMarketingSoftware.com. And today I'm going to talk to you about five super affiliate marketing tips for winners. But before I go on, I'd like to ask you to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Okay, a lot of people, what they do is they'll just take their affiliate link and they just start putting it out everywhere. And they might get a few sales here and there, but you're not really developing a long-term business strategy as a affiliate marketer. You know, as an affiliate marketer, you really want to create your own audience. And that starts with creating your own list. So rather than focusing just on trying to get sales from an affiliate link right away, what I would do is I would set up a, an opt-in page that people could opt in to your list for. If you're going to spend money on advertising, if you're going to spend time on advertising, you don't want to just have one shot at the person. You want to get that list, that person on your list so you can market to them over and over again, because you're going to change programs. You're going to find new programs. Uh, what happens if, <clears throat> if the program goes out of business and that the only thing you've ever promoted is that one thing and you don't even have a list of people that you, you advertise to, you can spend a lot of money on advertising and easily lose money. You want to take your money that you spend on advertising and leverage it as much as possible. So I would suggest going for the opt in before going for the sale, because you can drip feed email marketing campaigns to people every four or five days with different uh, emails about the benefits of the products that you're, you're recommending. And usually it takes about seven or eight follow-ups before people start buying. They need to feel confident. They need to start having a relationship with you. So if you really want to be a super affiliate, affiliate that makes a lot of money with affiliate marketing, and I've made tens of thousands of dollars affiliate marketing, even though I concentrate mainly on selling my own products and services, I do also uh, do quite a bit with affiliate marketing. I make money every single month with affiliate marketing. Just build your list. And that requires you think to think a little bit longer term. And that's something that people really have a hard time with. They want to get an immediate sales right now. But the problem is you go and get immediate sales right now. Then what you need to create a machine. You need to create a whole audience that you can market to over and over again. So think about getting an autoresponder. You know, I recommend a Weber. I'll put a link below. If you want, that's just an easy way to get started. There's lots of different ways to get started. Uh, building a list, but just get started. Don't worry about being perfect. If you worry about being perfect, you never get anything done. Just the simple opt-in form will st start getting, getting you some business. Okay. So I have, I'll put a, a link also to another video I have on how to build a real dead, simple opt-in form, uh, with a Weber. Uh, and you know, I'm not exactly in love with them, but they are a very good service and it's really easy to get started. There's other ways to do it. Like here, you know, I'm using my own blog and I'm using uh, thrive themes, which is excellent, but that takes a little bit more time to set up. You can just get going right away with a simple opt-in page with a Weber. And then as you get going, you can learn some other methods too to build your list. You know, the, the key is to get started, get started. Don't worry about being perfect, but think a little bit longer term and start building your list. Here's a, another tip, which is kind of along the first one, but build your own community rather than just going for the sale. Okay. You know, super affiliates want to create a funnel, want to create a machine, which keeps delivering sales over and over again. But really to do that, you have to have an audience and you have to give people valuable content. That's, that's what I'm doing now. I'm creating my own YouTube channel and I'm putting out tips that I think are helpful for people and I'm putting it out there and. People are going to join my a newsletter. People are going to see about the products and services that I offer. Maybe join some of my affiliate programs because I manage affiliate programs. I got thousands of affiliates in my affiliate program. So what do I do? I put out YouTube videos that I think will, will help people. And you should, you can do the very same thing. So here's some things you can do to create your own audience. YouTube's great. All right. It's a great way. There's a lot of traffic on, on YouTube and you know, don't worry about selling stuff right away. Just start. You can chronicle your own journey. People want authenticity. Don't have to be perfect. Don't have to have the slickest presentation. Just give people some r real information. Go research a topic that you're interested in and around the subject of 
of what you're interested in selling and start putting out YouTube videos about it. And you'll find that you'll begin to begin, you'll begin to start being an expert in that field. Even if you don't know, the best way to learn is to teach. So don't worry about being perfect. So you could start your own YouTube um, a channel. Like I'm doing a screencast video right now. And I use a free program called screencast Domatic. I upgraded to the pro one. It's like 40 some odd dollars for a year. Really great deal. I mean, it works beautifully. They host your videos. That's just one way you can get started doing videos. I know some people don't feel comfortable speaking on camera. Maybe English is not their first language. I would tell them not worry about it. Even if you have an accent, go ahead and do it. People don't care. They want authenticity. But if you're really that shy, you can get the thing called audio article video robot. There's other software out there like that, which will take articles, anything that you write, like I put this article and pop it in there and it will turn it into a video for you with actually kind of a live people there speaking your words. But people do prefer your voice, even if it's you got an accent, even if you're not perfect, they prefer generally an authentic experience. You can start your own blog uh, like I've done. Just start telling people what you learned, what works, what doesn't work. It's very easy to do. You can set up and get your own domain name and uh, an installation of WordPress. You can learn how to do that very easily just by Googling on how to do it. It's, it's not that hard. If you really need help, you can go to Fiverr or freelancer.com, hire someone to do it. No problem. But I suggest learning yourself. It's not that hard. You could Google, hey, how to set up a how to set your own domain name and hosting account, how to set up a blog, a WordPress blog. You'll find so many articles you want, don't know what to do with. I have one here. I'll put the link below. So you can start your own YouTube channel, your own blog. We already talked about starting your own list. You'll need an autoresponder service, a mailing service. There's a lot of them out there. Just for simplicity's sake, I said I recommend Dave Weber. I'll put some links down there. Of course, set up your social media accounts around your community as well start posting information again these are longer term strategies um i know everyone wants everybody wants sales right now but that's just not how it works really um you what happen if you just constantly go for the sale right now you maybe you'll get a few sales and then what you haven't built anything see when you're building your community you're building a whole audience you know i'm not spending hardly any money on advertising and i've got people subscribing to my newsletters all the time. I'm getting sales all the time, every single day. You know, they say on autopilot, but it took me years to build it up. Um, but that's what you need to go for. Then you have a real business. You see, you're not just chasing after a sale. You can get your own forum too. Why not be the authority forum in your niche or in, in your industry? You can get free software, PHP. BB software has been around forever. V Bulletin, it's a paid software. It's it's really the, the gold standard for forum software. Get your own hosting account, your topic, and you can maybe put your little banners and and newsletters on there. Get get creative. You have a whole community around your niche and you're developing an audience and those people can subscribe to your newsletters and so, and they can all work together. You know, some of my sites, I put videos from my YouTube channel that people subscribe to the YouTube channel on the YouTube channel. I put links to my, um, my mailing list. People can join the mailing list. Everything works synergistically. So think about that. Creating a community around your niche, choose the niche that you want. It doesn't have to be the make money niche either. All right. Most people start with that. It could be something completely different. Most likely other niches will work better than the make money niche. People are attracted to the make money niche because they look online how to make money and then they find make money type things and it's kind of this endless circle. But you know, if there's something you, you're really good at outside of that, you might be able to teach people how to do that, have a course on how to do what you know how to do. You might do better outside that niche. So think about it, especially if you're passionate about it and you know about it, you might start there rather than you know, the make money online niche, which is very popular, uh, you know, a lot of competition. Again, another tip, think long term and keep the pipeline filled with prospects. You know, a good salesperson doesn't look at the sales. He looks at how many people he talks to. All right. So a good salesperson will say, I'm going to talk to 10 people a day, every single day for 30 days. Then I'm going to look at results. They don't look at the results. You want to keep that pipeline filled. 
If you keep doing the actions that create sales, even if for a few days or weeks, even you're not getting them. If you keep doing those actions, keep putting out blog posts, keep putting out YouTube videos, keep building your email list, keep, keep responding to your customers, keep giving personal service. You're going to start getting sales. It's going to start working, but people are, are scared. A lot of times they quit before they become successful. You've got to have a little longer horizon than just five minutes. And unfortunately, a lot of that's been sold online. Make money now, do nothing. You can, you can see that pitch thousands of times uh, with different pitches and it's a very powerful pitch. People go for it, but unfortunately it doesn't work. So I'm saying think a little bit longer term, think of it as a business. Okay. Here's another tip. Offer personal service. No one wants to do this th these days. If you don't have any sales, you know, put your phone number on your website and talk to people. People want to talk to people. You know, right now I'm so busy. I barely have time to do that. And I don't like that. So I've got to figure out a way to delegate so I can offer more personal service, you know, but I still really try to offer personal service to every, every single person. Um, you know, if you don't have any sales, what the heck, put your phone number on there and answer the phone. You will get sales just because of that, because most of your competition will not be willing to talk to people if they're busy. They just want everything to happen by email. So think about that. You know, you have to be willing to do what other people aren't willing to do. And here's another tip. Offer a special unique bonus, you know, set up a web page and learn how to set up a web page where you could offer a special bonus. This is especially true for popular programs. There are a lot of programs out there that are just being bombarded. It's not that they're bad programs. They're good programs that you have a hard time making a sale. If you're just using the same affiliate link and the same landing page as everyone else, but you could put out your own landing page with your own bonus tips, your phone number, maybe offering personal coaching and helping. And people can find this through Google. If you do some good SEO on that page and you can use the popularity of that program to draw people to you because you're, you're offering something other people are not, you know, bottom line, there's no shortcut. You've got to be willing to offer more than everyone else. You got to stand out from the crowd. And here's a great technique to do it. Come up with some different bonuses. You know, on my sites, I give away free software and that has worked fantastic. And you're actually welcome to give away my software, my free software, if you want. So you can uh, uh, use that as an incentive to get people to join your list, or you can come up with your own bonuses and personal service could be a bonus, you know, offering coaching. Uh, hey, I'll help you out with this. I'll show you how it works. You know, I have software that I sell and give away and I suggest people use this windows VPS because it just works better. And really the only reason I recommend it, because I just know it'll work better for people and it makes my life easier, but you know, I have affiliate link, you know, I make like 20 bucks for recommending it. And what I tell people is, listen, if you get the VPS from my link, I'll set up the software for you. It takes me just a few minutes and also it makes it easier for them. So they don't, I've overcome that technical hurdle that they're worried about. They're worried that they won't know how to do it. Hey, I'll just do it for them. Just order from my link. I make a few bucks on it. It's not my primary purpose is to make money from the affiliate program, but I, I still do make money from it and it helps the people. But I, you know, the technique is I'm offering a personal service. I'm someone else may be referring the same hosting company, but are they offering to set it up for them? All right. So I'm offering a bonus. I'm offering personal service. So these are, these are just some things to think about, you know, think longer term, develop your audience, set up your YouTube channel. Don't just go for the sale right away. Get, um, get people in your list and change your thinking from just trying to get a sale right, right now. All right. To maybe have a 30 day plan of putting out content and, and, and put, putting out, building your, your audience and building your list and then evaluate. Don't, you know, evaluate your stats every two seconds. You know, give yourself a, 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 some time to get some momentum going. You know, if you put out a blog post and a video, YouTube video every day, and you're on social media every day, and you're building your list every day, if you're consistent, which is not an easy thing to do. Uh, I haven't put out a video every single day. I have way more, way more people following me. I get caught up dealing with customers and so forth. But you could do that. You'll build some momentum. You really will. But you have to be able to work without seeing immediate results. And that's extremely hard for some people. And I totally understand, 
but I just want to let you know the mindset of people who are super affiliates. And I'm doing this every single day. I get sales every single day. All right. So, and, and I don't have a, a lot of paid advertising. All right. A lot of it's just through natural traffic and things I've built organically. So it can be done, but it does take time. So, Hey, I hope these super affiliate tips help you. If you like the video, Hey, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Give it a like. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment areas. I will also put the link to the blog post here where I discuss everything I'm discussing with you here um, down below. And you can look at the blog post and get more information as well. Thank you so much. This is Matthew May with QuickRegisterSEO.com. Hey, but wait, there's more. Hey, I'd like to ask you, invite you actually, to join my affiliate program with ClassifiedSubmissions.com. Uh, I pay out every single month thousands of dollars to people it's a really good really good seller we're constantly working on improving the service as well and it's 50 percent recurring commissions so if you get a sale and per person stays subscribed you keep getting paid and we can pay up by, by a number of different methods so we're able to pay people from all over the world and what we've done too is you can if you have an aweber autoresponder account you can automatically get a copy of all our follow-up messages put into your autoresponder in with just a couple clicks they have a sharing system where you can share email messages so you could use all our sales messages in your autoresponder and use those to help build your list including uh, giving away our free software which gives people incentive to join the list so I have a video which shows talks about that and I'll put a link to the video um, so that you can go and check out the video on how to get all of our sales messages and put them in your AWeber account. So in any case, I'd like to invite you to join our affiliate program, pays recurring commissions 50% at classifiedsubmissions.com and apply some of these super affiliate techniques because we're looking for super affiliates and we hope that's you. Thanks so much.